Hello, friends. James O'Keefe here. As you all know, we're located in the town of Mamaroneck, New York. Mamaroneck in Westchester County is about 45 minutes north of New York City. Mamaroneck was one of the hardest hit areas of the storm that passed through last night, September 1st. The Project Veritas office was devastated by floodwaters that rose almost five to six feet into our office above the floor. These are some images and scenes and some video from this morning. The good news is all of our people are safe and all of our footage seems to be secure. The bad news is most other things and our headquarters were completely destroyed. Last night, most of our staff were excitedly watching a stream of the board meeting in Sacramento, California, with indignant parents on the verge of tears after we exposed an Antifa teacher who, it was announced, was going to be fired. We were so excited we barely noticed the floodwaters and the torrential downpour outside of our doors. When we walked outside at 10 or 11 o'clock, some of our employees found their vehicles surrounded by three feet of water. We do appreciate the support and funding to continue. We are, after all, a nonprofit organization. We appreciate the flood of tips and whistleblowers coming to us even today. We are still in the field, many of us working on many stories. We appreciate the prayers and all of your support. We were going to release our next story early next week. We might be delayed another week as we dig through our wreckage, salvage what we can, and rebuild our infrastructure. We are a very resilient organization, but perhaps the most resilient people of any organization anywhere. And we often find ourselves rising like a phoenix out of the ashes repeatedly over the last decade. Continuously attacked by external forces since the beginning when we were nothing but a laptop and a Yeti microphone in the second floor of an old carriage house. Last night's storm was devastating for us. We lost a lot, but we are alive. Above a door at the San Juan Capistrano mission is the word resurgent. I shall rise again. Sometimes devastation begets bigger and better things. We too will rise again, and we will do it as we do anything we do, like no one else does, in part because this team is so united in ensuring our mission continues. Our insiders need us to continue fielding tips. The parents from last night need us to continue exposing corrupt teachers. So we will rise, and we will do it together. One of my favorite poems is from Kipling wrote to meet with triumph and disaster and meet those two imposters just the same if you could see the things you gave your life to broken and build them again with worn out tools project veritas insiders and undercover journalists much like the patriots that support us and protect us will never be defeated by outside forces it will only be because we chose to stop persevering it will only be because we defeat ourselves